Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel with another informative and useful video. So guys, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to fix Snapchat notification not working issue on iPhone after iOS 18 update. So guys, if you are facing this problem and you don't know that, how can you fix this issue? So guys, in this video, I will show you how can you fix it. So let's start our video without wasting any time. So guys, our first step is to check Snapchat notification settings. For that you have to just simply open settings and from here guys scroll it below and here you will see the option of notifications simply tap on it scroll down and here you will see the option of snapchat and you have to make sure that the allow notification is enabled if it is disabled then simply enable it and check if the problem is fixed or not if the problem is still there guys then you have to just simply restart your device for one time sometime a simple restart can resolve many issues for that you have to just simply open settings again Tap on general, scroll down and here up, tap on shutdown, shut down your iPhone to 15 to 20 seconds and after that open it again and check if the problem is fixed or not. If the problem is still there guys then you have to just simply tap on iPhone storage and from here guys scroll down and here tap on snapchat from here offload the app and reinstall it again and check if the problem is fixed or not. If the problem is still there guys then you have to just simply open app store and search here for snapchat and you have to make sure that there is no update if there is update then you have to just simply update it first and check if the problem is fixed or not after trying this step then you have to make sure that the do not disturb mode is not enabled if the enable then you have to just simply disable it and after this check if the problem is fixed or not if the problem is still there guys then you have to just simply press and hold the app and remove the app and reinstall it again from the app store after trying this step, hopefully your problem will be fixed. So that's it for today guys. Hope this video helps you. If the video has helped you, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel as well. Thank you.